last muscle to angle back to. Not again. Right, let's have a look for him. Hi. What are you doing up there? Well, I thought we was being slops. No, I said we're learning about the slop. Oh, right. If you guys haven't already guessed, today we're learning about the slop. <coughs> Sloths are solitary animals, living in the rainforest of Central South America, up in the canopy of the trees. They're able to travel from tree to tree using the vines up in the canopy. By spending almost all of their time up in the trees, they're able to remain hidden from predators. That's pretty smart, right? And with their long arms and shaggy fur, sometimes they can look like a monkey, but they're actually related to the armadillo and the anteaters. They sleep between 15 and 20 hours a day and only come down to the forest floor once a week to go to the toilet. I need a wee. They normally have a low body temperature as they don't move much, so they move in and out of the shade to regulate this. They are also actually very strong swimmers and will sometimes drop down from the top of the canopies into the water below and they will use their long arms to propel themselves through the water. Sloths are well known for being extremely slow. This is due to their really slow metabolic rate, taking them days to digest what other animals can digest in a matter of hours, which also means they don't actually have to eat that much. Their diet consists of leaves, twigs and buds. And seems as they don't have incisors, they chew the leaves up by smacking their lips together. They are quite sluggish animals, and they can only travel up to about 41 yards per day. That's less than the size of half a football field. Some scientists believe that sloths developed a slow motion lifestyle in order to be less noticeable to predators. However, if they are caught, they can become aggressive, biting, hissing, scratching with their claws and even shrieking. They're also able to camouflage themselves within the trees as algae actually grows on their fur, making them look a bit greenish. When they do reach the ground, they move about by digging their front claws into the dirt and dragging their bodies. There are two main species of sloth, the two-toed and the three-toed. They're identified by either having two or three claws on the bottom of their feet. The two-toed is slightly bigger than the three-toed and they spend more time hanging from the trees. Whereas the three-toed sloth spends more time sitting upright in the fork of a tree branch. They also have facial markers that makes them look like they're always smiling. They're also able to turn their heads almost all the way around, making it easier to look out for predators. For those of you who've watched The Goonies, what did the one sloth say to the other sloth? Hey you guys! Bye, Bye guys! guys.